you another uh, GTA Online video. In today's video, I'm going to be going over the terabyte. Last video, I went over the uh, MOC, and then before that, I went over the yacht. Now I'm going to be going over the terabyte. Um, first, you can store your press mark 2 in there. Um, and you can also have certain access to your friends, radios, and everything like that. Just basic stuff. Same with the MOC, which I didn't cover in my, or I covered in my last video, but I didn't cover this in my last video. You have to get your terabyte by requesting it through this menu. And then if I call in my Mark II. Then I can find my terabyte is the truck thing. It tells you in the top left. Um, what your terabyte looks like on the map or you can go to the interaction and find it there we go so I'm gonna turn around here go in here Uh, the main reason that I use it and I I use and I've seen people use the terabyte is for the press mark two. Um, you drive up to it and you press right on the D-pad, which brings you into the terabyte. And you have the little storage here. You can get on it, and then you can change it. You can add armor, uh, countermeasures. I use the flare because if somebody shoots a rocket at you, then uh, it'll drop down. I don't really know what the purpose of that smoke is. I haven't really seen any uh, engine. You got an engine block because if you don't have it, um, as you can see, it's way easier to hit the engine. Um, I'm pretty sure that's what that's for. And you have the engine tunes. Basically, makes it go faster. Um, yeah, increase. Oh, well, it makes it stop faster. Sorry. Is what it says. Increased brake horsepower. You have lights. Have lights. You have liveries. All the same liveries as on the car, I'm pretty sure. Um, loss and theft pre prevention. You can respray it. You can add your crew emblem. You can sell it. I wouldn't recommend doing that at all. Explosive MG. Oh, I thought that they were j they were only missiles. I didn't notice there were explosive MGs. So you can get an explosive MG, which I forgot about. Um... Which I personally think the homing missiles are actually better because yes, the explosive MGs are explosive, but the homing missiles can lock on and shoot. It can lock on the cops. It can lock on to signal jammers. It can lock on to other players. Um, so I think those are better. And then that's really it for this part. Um, so I'm gonna get off of this. You can. Should be able to. Yeah, Mark II uh, weapons here, just like in the MOC. Uh, you can change the different types of clips. You can um, get the different variants. And basically, just stuff like that. Bodyguard variant looks pretty nice, I think, personally. Uh, and then you got the black tent, and you got the army tent. And just all the different types of tents, just like on a normal gun. But uh, basically, all that is, is you upgrade it to Mark II, and you can get different bullets and stuff like that. You get all these different missions, which I was talking about with the MOC. Um, these are actually really good missions. You can do client jobs, um, which can give you about 30k uh, per, I'm pretty sure, up to 50k though. Air freight cargo, I wouldn't recommend doing that from here, but you can do a air freight cargo from here. And same with special cargo. These are basically just crates for different things, um, which, don't get me wrong, it is good to do here, but... Um, at the same time, you're going to have to think um, where it might land. I, I would recommend doing it here for certain reasons, but I wouldn't for other reasons. Basically, you're mobile, but you're not at your uh, CEO. Vehicle cargo, same, and then these two. You then have this, which I'm trying to sit down in. There we go. Then you can fly a drone. 
and this is required for certain uh, things it's like diamond heist. Okay, I'm proud of this little guy. They may be small and fragile, but they're super and maneuverable. You the left, you're gonna move, move it around. You can detonate truck, it if you want to. to shock people with the built-in stunner. Or if it's a and then you can also mission, shock people. The detonator should take someone out. So, for example, if I go over to... Oh, no, I, I don't want to boost anymore. Okay. If I go over to this guy, I can either shock him. Which should have knocked him out. Okay, I accidentally destroyed it. It is really uh, easy to destroy. If you, like, tap something, then it will be destroyed, and then you'll have to wait. Um... Let's go ahead and go into here. You can also drive it just like you can drive an MSC. I'll show that in a second, but I want to show all this stuff. Oh, there's the interior tent. And then this is a little more customizable. Interior, interior decal. So I think this is wall stuff. Yeah, it's wall stuff. So if you look at the, towards the left, you can see the, the wall changing. Um, some of these aren't really worth it, some of them are, because some of them you can barely see a difference. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You have the turret station, so basically, you have a turret on your, um, on your thing, which, I think that this is for, um, air targets. Uh, back in the five separate target. Okay, so this is like five different targets, and you can use it to attack people. And then you have the drone station which I just showed, fly drone, weapon workshop which lets you do uh, uh, mark two weapons and then specialized workshop which is for your oppressor. Um, I can't do a video about the Avenger today but um, because I don't have it but I might grind to get it. Um, if you have any other videos I you want me to do I can show you the cars that I have um, for, for some reviews. I have the Savage, I can review that. I can review the Insurgent, the Cargo Bob, the the Oppressor, um, the Rogue. I can review the Vigilante, the Laser. Jolly, the jetpack, um, the mule custom, but that's really just for nightclub, the scramjet, the oppressive mark II, um, the invade and persuade tank, um, which I really don't recommend getting. And then I can recommend some cars in here. I guess I'll go ahead and show you guys uh, the cars, or not recommend, but uh, show off some of the cars in here if you guys want to see them. Um, Tesseract. Tesseract, J Devasty 8, Furia, um, some other cars. But I don't really want to go into all of those today. Um, I can review some other uh, vehicles if you guys want me to. Just tell me down in the description below. If you guys did enjoy this video, please do uh, like it. If you didn't like it, uh, please do tell me why down in the description below. If you really liked it or like to see daily Red Dead Online content or and daily Modern Warfare content and frequent GTA Online content, um, then please do subscribe. If you're kind of on the fence, then maybe watch another video. And uh, if you like that one, please do consider again subscribing. Um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Hope you did enjoy, and goodbye.